last night I, we were speaking to a young man who was trying to get answers to some crucial questions and talking about doubting Allah I said where were you one year before you were born where were you do you remember no I want to ask you another question one month before you were born where were you can you say it please say it one month before you were born where were you I know you are big men but tell me where were you in your mother's in your mother's womb one month before you were born where were you in your mother's womb but do you remember that anyone remember please put up your hand and come and let us know thanks anyone remember but wallahi you were there don't you believe you were there why because people told you they showed you they showed you hey look the scan when you were you were kicking a lot your mom will say right you were kicking so much do you remember no you don't so why do you believe it you believe it because people told you about it right what about before that? Where were you? Well, you were part in your mom and part in your dad in the form of eggs, perhaps, and so on. Agreed? Do you remember? Not at all. But were you there or not? Yes, you were. Subhanallah. Allah speaks about it in Surah Al-Dahr that man doesn't realize he was created from a droplet. Subhanallah. But you were there. You don't remember. But people told you, science told you, anyone else told you, then you were quick to believe Allah already told it to you. And Allah says, you know where you are right now? You will cross another membrane into the hereafter. That is going to be amazing and mind boggling. Let me tell you why. When you were little in the womb of your mother and you were swimming around the entire womb, guess what was happening? You were excited, there was warmth, there was protection, there was food, there were nutrients, you were growing, you were happy, you were so superbly unique. Everything was cool and calm for you. No matter what happened to your mother, you were okay and you kept on gaining weight. You were happy. As you gained more and more weight, what happened? The space became less. Agreed? When space became so less and now you can't even move. What happened? You probably thought, you know what? It's the end. It's finished. It's over. It's done. What's going to happen to you? I don't know. Where are you going to go? No idea. It's finished. I'm sure people who never believe in the hereafter never even believe that there was life outside the womb, right? They never believe there's life outside the womb. But little did you know there is a thin membrane between you as a fetus and the real world out there, which is totally different. What is there? There is a thin membrane between you and that real world. And when you thought it's all over, suddenly you came out into the real world. You were born and you were crying. Subhanallah. You were crying because it was overwhelming. Something amazing happened. What happened? I came out into something I never imagined existed. Imagine I'm outside my mother for the first time and I'm looking at this mother whom I was in her womb. Subhanallah. Unique. It's amazing. Allah kept it such that none of us, there is no exception. Not one of us can remember the day we were born. If you can, I told you we will give you a medal come and stand here and let us know you don't remember but you believe it because you were told that's what it is I am equally convinced that between me and the hereafter there is also a thin membrane the minute I cross it I will be oh wow subhanallah we won't be crying. We will be smiling. We are believers. We developed a relationship with the one we are going to return to with Allah. We tried hard. We sought forgiveness. We, we went to him. We, we prayed to him. We did whatever we had to. When we go through that one membrane, it is challenging because there is anxiety of the unknown. But my faith will take me across. It's not going to be a tough day for the believers. 
you believed in your Lord, in the maker, you believed in Allah, then don't worry, that will be a beautiful day by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You cross that membrane and you go into a beautiful hereafter. You will be so, so, so impressed. You will only remember small pockets of things about the earth. That too, only what Allah wants you to remember. Because you don't remember anything from the womb. What gives you a guarantee you're going to remember everything from the earth when you go the other side? You will only remember what Allah wants you to remember.